two players play a game. The game involves tossing a coin. If the coin ends up heads, player A gets a point. If the coin ends up tails, player B gets a point. The first person to get 10 points wins a certain amount of money. Player A is winning 8 to 7, when player B receives an urgent message that they must leave immediately, and the game cannot be continued in the foreseeable future. How should the pot be divided? This was the problem that inspired probability theory between Pascal and Fermat. So how could you answer this? Well, you could just give each player 50% of the pot, but that doesn't seem fair. Or you could say player A gets 8 fifteenths of the pot, and player B gets 7 fifteenths of the pot. But under this reasoning, it's the situation that happened after one game that player A would have won 100% of the pot. So here's what Pascal and Fermat decided. The most games we would have to play is f the most additional games we would have to play is four. One player will always win. In eleven of those games, player A would win. In five of those games, player B would win. So player A would get eleven sixteenths of the pot, and player B would get five sixteenths of the pot. Bye.